All right, kind of a quick video tour here of the yurts. So walking up onto the deck, I'm going through the French doors. This is the 30 foot yurt main living area. So take a step in, a fan and pergola or opening dome, tinted dome, a door out the back to the other yurt. There's the two ton uh, mini split heat pump. The wood stove, uh, you can see a lot of plug-ins, there's a four plug-in, another four plug-in prong, another four plug-in prong, um, and then the main power uh, breaker here, so light switches, etc. Um, going back back around the yurt, um, and again, just still just come in the door, take a right here is the bathroom slash laundry room so we have a sink and a vanity um, the heat pump water heater uh, which is here and then on the back side this unfinished wall uh, we were planning to build uh, cabinets and things but the washer and dryer hook up there along with 220 um, some more outlets and things like that um, that's about 10 to 12 feet uh, that length there but the back side of the appliances so light switch Coming back out into the main living area, uh, this is the kitchen, so some lights overhead. This is the, the sink, um, cabinets, fridge, etc. Some windows. Kind of walk around into the kitchen, and there's our refrigerator, um, convection stove oven. Again, these are all about 13, 14 months old now. Some open cabinets and other cabinetry, lots and lots of storage. Um, super, super quiet. Dishwasher, can't even hear it, but plenty of room for utensils, storage. Uh, there's a lazy Sue's in there, so these are kind of a pain to open, but that's that in there, and it can spin around. But sink, uh, standard sink and storage, plenty of room. And then if you want to go out the back side, I'm walking into the other yurt, uh, just another fan going, uh, windows, some more plug-ins, plenty of plug-ins for bedroom appliances and things, window, heater, uh, heat pump, mini pump, that's a one-ton unit, and uh, electrical to come into it, going back around, another window, let's back nook area we had uh, clothing so shelves for clothes and all of that um, that's finished on top so you can store stuff on top of the bathroom there's sound insulated uh, uh, some tenants did some artwork it looks like on the walls but um, coming into the bathroom but clawfoot tub um, shower goes all the way up shower ring um, stored towels and things here composting toilet uh, which unfortunately they left on the heating element but not the fan from the plugs and it, it melted it. Um, there is another composting toilet that's brand new that is a different a separate unit that sits underneath um, if you'd like to use that instead. Another vanity madness cabinet drawers and then this is another heat pump portable one um, help keep it dry in here after showers or warm up on a cold day so just a regular heat pump heat or air conditioning um, or dehumidified mode. So that explains that and I'll take one more of the uh, of the outside.